hello guys and welcome to this video in this video we'll be talking about four things buy stop sell stop buy limit sell limit so to begin let's show the intro all right welcome back and so what what is this uh uh the types of execution we have just uh, talked about here so the other time in our last video some of our videos back we talked about it that we have two types of execution market execution and pending execution now pending order rather market execution is instant you just click sell or you click buy right however pending orders they are used to give i mean to enter into the market at a specific time when the market has traded uh, up to a price that you want to be filled in so first and in the list of pending order is buy limit so what is buy limit now using up uh, uh, this example let's uh, explain what buy limit is all about so let's say the this is the highs of the market right and this is the low of the market right now prices are not here yet prices are here right now however you want to buy the you want to get into the market when prices comes to this area here right because it came here earlier on right so this is some very low of it so you believe the market the prices of the market will increase will rise from this region upwards to this high so you want to get to the market here into the market at this area at this price uh, at this area here when prices get to this uh, level right this region at 17 5, 4, 5, 3, for instance so what you do is you place a buy limit so let's type that right here so let's say uh, buy limit okay good right here because you believe when you, when prices get to this point it's gonna hit support and move back up right so here you buy you, you use buy limit you want to be filled into the market when prices reach this area here so that's basically what happens so right now you can go to sleep you can set your stop loss uh whatever you want to set your stop loss and then let's say here and then you can just go to sleep or whatever it is you want to do and then when the market when prices get to this low it's your trades will now be activated uh high probable options of the market going rising back of this area so that's buy limit for you now what about sell limits so sell mean limit is the other way around you are selling from the highs you believe when the market gets to a high point right it will fall back down because it's going to hit resistance so let's say uh prices go to this point and it rolls back up to this area right here where we're keeping our sell limit right and you believe because it's the highs right and you always set the highs right while it is up you believe when the prices get here it's going to come back down so what do you do you place a sell limit order right here right so let's see if we can actually uh execute some of these orders uh right now uh pending order let's say buy limit let's put it at um 17 and uh, let's make it one for instance and place it uh okay five okay there you go so this is our buy limit order right then let's place a sell limit so what will happen if prices should fall down to this area we will put our buy limit it will fill us in and we hope the market will rise back up so what about sell limit sell limit on the other hand if the prices rise high up and you believe the prices of the of, of the prices will fall back down from the highs to the low you place a sell limit so let's place a sell limit right now and see how it goes and then you come here and you say sell limit and you look at the price you want to get into the market let's say this area here which is 19.73 19.3743 3743 whatever 
so you see this is our sell limit so whatever it whenever the prices of the market rises back up to this area here is going to fill you in your trades will be activated and in the hopes that the market will slump back down so this is what uh buy limit and sell limit this is what they stand for they represent and i hope you understand this now what about uh the other pending orders that we have we have uh, uh buy stop and sell stop now buy stop on the other hand is this right now the market the prices are here right if you believe the prices of the market will rise uh, at a certain point prices will rise from this area here and find its way back up and you want to get into the market let's say at this point right here before it goes back up right what you do is you place a buy stop order oh my good lord this noise you place a buy stop order and you put it right here so at this price is here let's say 18 10 70 and you say 18 18 10 70 and you say okay you see now so our buy stop has been placed here right so let's just uh, type this and say buy stop uh, buy stop okay and we'll put it here right however if you think and you believe the prices right uh, we feel prices will feel and uh, prices will not get to this point however you think the price will continue to drop back down right now it is here if you think it's gonna go before drop from this point and go downwards you want to execute you want to enter the market when price gets to this level this area here at say 17.7217 you place a step a sell stop so let's say 17 uh where is it you place a let's change this color real quick sorry and you sell a sell stop okay okay there you go you execute this you put a sell stop order here and you enter the price you want 17449 for instance and you say sell stop pending order rather and you say sell stop and yeah you go 17 17 right something like that okay it's too high and this is our bar limit our sell limit you can actually adjust it price are not there yet so what happens if the market continues to slump down right say prices fall down like this when it gets to this price here you will get filled in your trade will be activated and if it continues downward you will make your profit right so this is how uh sell sell stop and buy stop works sell stop you believe prices will continue to go down but you don't want to enter the market right now so you allow prices to come back down as it's falling it's active you and your trade is activated and you continue to ride the market down however if you think the market is going to go up right uh from here uh, but you don't want to get into the market right now you want to get to this place before you get your trade gets activated you issue a buy stop so when the market trades and gets here your trades are triggered your, your trades are activated and it continues to just trade right uh, up and you make uh your profit so basically this is how how the buy stop and the sell stop they work i hope you understand if you do not understand please drop a comment ask whatever questions you want to ask and then we can explain more uh furthermore uh i don't want to make this video very long so we are ending it here i hope you get you understand all of this we have just said so guys if you really uh like this video if you appreciate what we have done please uh smash the like button subscribe and until next time take care